This is an ad for Duolingo ABC. I'm nervous to travel by myself. It's been so long since I have, like, by myself. But it might be peaceful. I love you guys so much. Yeah, you gotta go. Love you. Miss you. Miss you. Love you. So I made it to my gate. You guys are probably wondering, what are you doing at the airport? Kids were sad to see me go, and it sucks that I had to leave them, but I'll be back later on tonight. I'm actually going to Tampa to go look at some buses, and hopefully I leave with one. Yeah, I'm about to get on a plane and possibly come home with a bus. Hello, how are you? Thank you. Wilder has been really into this app called Duolingo ABC. And so we've been playing with that a little bit today. So thank you so much to Duolingo ABC for sponsoring today's video. Duolingo is a fun free app we're using to help the kids learn to read. This is the perfect time for the sponsor because we're transitioning our life into traveling and we're gonna be on the road a lot. So something like this is gonna be really useful, especially because we are planning on homeschooling. So if we use screen time to learn like this, yeah. because it's super beneficial to your little brains. Actually, your big brain. You got a big brain in there? Duolingo ABC is a game-based app. It's a fun game, but it's most importantly an educational app, which I love. We did it! You did it, yay! I really, really love all the stories on here. Wilder is super, super into it. He's never really been a huge bookworm. He he does like his books, but I feel like this app has really sparked more of an interest to read stories. Literally, after he gets off of the app, he comes to me and he's like, Mommy, tell me a story. So I've really, really been loving that out of this. And also, I just really love the handwriting tool. He literally knows how to write his name now, which is crazy. It really makes for like actual effective screen time and not just like YouTube or YouTube kids, you know? I really think that it's gonna come in handy on the road right. because it's completely free and it's super easy to use. There are tons of fun games and stories, which is what Wilder's yeah. listening to right now, where kids can learn things like letter sounds yeah. and try sounding out the words. There's even handwriting lessons where they learn to trace letters and even write their own name. And he's pretty much fully learned to write his own name from that, which is really cool. Duolingo ABC really fits into our family, especially for times like this when the other babies are sleeping. We just have us time. Even Hazel loves the app too, but Wilder especially. It's just super easy and a good learning downtime. I highly, highly recommend if you guys want to check it out, download the Duolingo ABC app through the link in my description box below, or you can search for the Duolingo ABC app through the app. Around your feet to make sure you have everything you brought on board. Yeah, have a good day. Thank you. Thanks for the safe flight. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, so I made it off. I have like 10 minutes to get to my next flight, so I kind of have to hurry. It's 11.38. Boarding time is 11.44. I have less than 10 minutes. So I'm in T. I have to go all the way to A. So I have to hurry. No, 
not breathe. This is not easy. I'm gonna miss this flight. Into the tram. Nice little way to catch my breath. Almost there. I think I'm gonna make it. All right, so it looks like I made it. Just in the nick of time. Looks like I have a minute, so I'm gonna hit the little girls room really quick. All right, last point of the day. Hello. Thank you. Now that I'm off the plane, now I need to get an Uber, go get a bus. I think it's like 18 minutes away, so it's not a very far drive. I think I need to test drive it, test some stuff, have them show me some stuff, and then we'll be out of there. I think it says he's coming around right now. Are you? Hey, how are you? Hey, how are you? Good. How was your flight? Good? Yeah, it wasn't bad. You it's been a while. Uh, no, I'm actually going to pick up a bus oh, to, nice. uh, to like build a, um, basically turn it into an RV. Oh, sweet. All right, so we're pulling up to the bus place. We're here. This lot has like tons of buses. Right, yep. All right, man. I think, thank you. I appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. Be safe out there. Yeah. The buses. I think it's that one on the end, isn't it? The one at the end, yep. yep. There's no AC in this bus, so it is gonna be so hot of a drive back home. So the camera died. I'm about to take this thing for a test ride, and I'll let you guys know what I decide. I'm back from the test drive. Everything went smooth. Now we're just kind of like filling out paperwork and signing the money orders. I should be on my way after that. All right, so I'm walking to my bus that I now own. This is crazy. I didn't even show you guys. Like here's the here's the yard of all the buses, different kinds of buses. I hear mine out there already. We parked it outside of the gate so I could just take off. Oh, it just feels weird. I'm a bus owner now. That's crazy. Anyways, I'm hopping in the bus for the first time as a bus owner. Woo! This is our bus. We don't have a name for it yet, but we love her. We got some windows open. Hopefully it won't be too hot of a ride. Anything to hold a drink? Nothing to hold a drink? What the freak? Right. Alright, and we're off. We got the bus, baby! So far it's been a pretty big struggle to find a gas station that I can actually fit into lengthwise. Like turning a bus is really hard. You have to like take wide turns, you can't take U-turns. So like everything that you do is like hard left, hard left, or hard right, hard right, just to get turned around. Uh, I'm actually passing an RV park right now. What's up guys? I'm on the way to a truck stop right now, which will be where I'm gonna fill up for the first time. They will be able to accommodate a bus like me, so where we're headed. The overall driving and um, steering on this thing has actually not been too bad. It's pretty easy to keep between the lines. You're just watching out for like semi trucks because they have a lot of pull um, whenever they drive by you. Um, push and pull really uh, just depends on where you're at next to it. Uh, but it hasn't been too bad. It really hasn't. Something else I learned, truck stops stink. 
They stay! They stay calm! Alright, so I'm going up into the neighborhood now. It's like 1 o'clock in the morning and this thing is really loud. So I'm sure the neighbors are like, what the heck is going on? I'm super tired. I'm trying to get inside like really quick. So this is how we have it parked in the yard. It's super dark out here so you can barely tell, but yep, at an angle. Awesome, man at home. We feel so grateful and so, so blessed that we finally found our butts, right? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we just found our butts. We, we found our butts. Guys, this is our first time seeing the butts. I love the butt. I'm so excited. Captain Wildy. I can come in? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, where are we going? The We're going to the ocean? Mm -hmm. All right, let's go. Good job. We're here. Thank you again to Duo Legal ABC for sponsoring today's video. Welcome to my house.